Welcome to the Providence Jewelry Museum. I'm Peter DiCristofaro, the president, and we're going to take you through the history of making jewelry, which began in Providence in the 1700s when British goldsmiths and silversmiths came here and took pieces of gold and laminated and sandwiched it to a metal of lesser value, sterling or bronze, and they began merchandising gold for the first time in American history. It was important because in countries that were below the equator, a plated chain or a plated piece of jewelry did not last on the body. But a clad piece of metal, which had real 14 karat gold, like this umbrella handle, would last forever. Those materials ended up drawing, drawing people to send merchandise from all over the world to Providence. The raw materials came from everywhere. We had lava from Italy, cameo and coral from Italy, we had ivory tusks from Africa, pearls from Japan, even animal pots. As you see, this grouse, hand, grouse foot and this beetle were made into jewelry. So the resources, Providence became a very globalized place in the 1700s.